Hey everyone, welcome to From the Depths. I'm Menti, and this is the ninth exhibition match of the Battleship Brawl Season 7 tournament. In this episode, we've got the Neolots by Mew2014. Going up against the One Punch by Sean Reed. Yes, the Thin Ship versus the Doom. Indeed. All right, let's get the prediction started. Neolots or One Punch? Prediction has begun. You've got one minute to place your bets. Missed your fight. I originally thought One Punch's gun was meant to be a penis. Yeah. I kind of thought that too. That's... Like when I first saw it, but then when you actually look at it, it's his hand. Anyway, let's go ahead and get this battle underway. Oh, geez, that one shot almost severed the Neolots. If it gets hit in that spot again, it's going to break in half. Let's see where One Punch aims for its second shot. Not quite the same spot. But it is making satisfying hauls. that barely even hit. Like, that's just the explosive dag damage because the fragments got sprayed out into the ocean. Holy cram, Batman. Yes, yes, indeed. Punch has gun been disabled. No. Oh. Where did that even hit? I'm not sure. Uh oh. Coming in for the kick. That did not go well for one punch. Uh oh. I think the, the one punch's gun might be disabled. Just because of the barrel, the barrel clipping off. Oh, I think I got an 80% in sinking. Yep. 80% in sinking into a two damaged. Seventy-eight point eight to zero in favor of the Neolots. All right, let's see how round two goes. Jeez. 
Jeez. <laughs> I think that may have been the HE bug. Because holy crap. bug specifically it's an he bug where for some reason it just does maximum damage to everything in the explosion radius we haven't ex i don't think we've exactly figured out how or why that happens yet it just sometimes does One punch is gun disabled again? Yep, looks like it is. The gun's probably still functional, it's just the barrel has been clipped shorter than the armor around it. Which means it can't fire. Looks like we got cram parts in the water. Get down to 11 firepower of cram. That's oof. Oh, and now it's dry firing. Lots of water skips from the Neolots.
Yeah, one punch is just has a little bit too much gun and not enough armor. Both timed and pen depth fuses coffee zombies. So like, if those sh if the neo lots of shells had timed fuses, they would detonate above the one punch okay, and deal damage, some damage to it, rather than just skipping over and doing nothing. That's a good that's a good point. Why pen depth if you already have timed? Because a timed one is already going to act as a pen depth, basically. I don't know. Eighty one point three to zero in round two. Let's go ahead and get round three started. Structure got absolutely wrecked. Yep, that's a dead turret. Two dead turrets. <laughs> Oh, did that just AI dead, the Neolots? Yep, the Neolots is AI dead. <laughs> Critical hit! Zero to 98.4. Still not enough for the one punch to come back and win, but, uh... It at least didn't get, you know, swept. Ninety nine percent of the the votes went to the Neolots, which was correct. No, I'm not doing a third match. We're gonna stick to the schedule. Plus six mats. <laughs> You're rich, and the Neolots is on fire. And floating. Kind of interesting to watch it despawn like that. And it's gone. Anyway, that'll be the end of this episode, end of the stream, folks. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you on the battlefield.